Now with KHO and two weather, Chris Latronic. Aloha Kakahiaka Kako. It is 6:52 on this Aloha Friday. Weather still looking nice. Trade wind still blowing, locally breezy, and that's going to happen all the way through Saturday before getting a little bit lighter into the moderate range with a new front that will be passing to the north of us. But today, that's not happening. We're seeing some nice double digits, 15 to 20 miles per hour trade winds we're expecting for today with a state forecast size similar to the pretty much the last three days between 81 and 86 degrees keeping us cool taking a look at our outside zephyr cam some low-level clouds being uh, pulled in uh, with our trade winds so mostly affecting the early morning and afternoon showers uh, so just be ready on that front otherwise you just be safe woodward sides are definitely going to see the bulk of that any leeward areas like the Kona coast will see a uh, possibilities of some shower activities that are the most sheltered from the trade winds taking a look at our our current condition 71 percent humidity because our trade winds clocking single digits right now north northeast at the airport a satellite radar showing that high pressure system that's we're thanking for the nice trade winds but you also see the frontal boundary that's making its way so around saturday into sunday we will see this move in passing us disrupting our trade winds just a bit uh, but not totally leaving us but we will see a little bit more prone areas for our leeward sides that we'll see a little bit more afternoon cloud cover and showers right now shower activity pretty sparse just have mostly the windward sides and just isolated cells uh, that are being pulled in with the trade winds that are blowing pretty definitely okay right now clocking uh, moderate though just single digits around the bend expect those to build throughout the day uh, 15 to 20 miles per hour is the trend and you can see into monday tuesday we will see a, a just an area of precipitation will come into play and that'll give us a little bit more chance of rain especially around wednesday but we'll keep you updated right here on k 2 2 and on the radio at am 1500 uh, but now it's time to check the big surf send things over to gary Cooley from the surf news network everything you need to know on this incoming west northwest swell good morning gq how are we hey. doing right now hey happy aloha friday chris well waimea bay still yawning and clearing its eyes but oh it's gonna pump today it'll get up to 20 feet there are 15 foot sets now but again it is building the first half of the day it'll be 15 to 20 plus on the north shore at the peak throughout the afternoon and slowly decline tomorrow through the weekend i'll tell you the buffalo big port serving classics gonna score big time it'll be very interesting we're looking at eight to ten for macaw here today we'll watch for some 12 footers again peaking uh, more towards lunch uh, southern shores flat 12 foot maybe two wrap is expected diamond is one to two sandy's makapu'u one to two and again isolated wrap especially for you know kuhuku area and light to moderate trades that are filling in the high surf warning were well above the criteria small craft advisories due to large open ocean swells for mariners and uh, the low tide here is at eight in the morning going to a small high tide at noon a minus low tide at 5, one sunset to go a minute later, 634, and rising big Saturday at 654.